Welcome back to Put a Sock in a Podcast featuring me and Lorraine. Hello, it's me, Lorraine. Larry, I'm known as Lorraine. And we're back. We are. We are, are we saying that we're in 2023? Yeah. Yeah, we're in the new year. We're five days in. 2023 it is today, January, oh, January 5th, 2023. Feels right. weird. Yeah, 2024 is next year. How nuts is that? No way. 2023 kind of felt real, just because you kept hearing it. Mm-hmm. 2024 doesn't even sound like... 23 doesn't sound real at all. Not to you? Not at all. I don't know. I'm kind of ready for it. Like, I, I felt as in, you know when you play, like, Xbox? Mm-hmm. Or, you know, like, the games come out, like, FIFA 23 comes out, like... I don't know what you're talking m- about. Months. Oh. Like, I've never played FIFA. 2K? Madden? I don't know who that is. Okay, well, I've been playing FIFA 23 for, like, months now, so I feel like I'm already in 2023. Are you, like, a big um, Xbox or PS4 guy? And this will determine... Okay, so this is, like, a real statement. What do you mean? Oh, no, it's one minute in this. I I feel like if I go either way, you're going to be like, No, okay, so Xbox were mainly played by white kids, and PS4 was kind of uh, diverse, and, like, it's so true, I promise you. Yeah. Did you have an Xbox? I've had an Xbox here and there. Did you have both? I mean, I have a PS5 now. You're kind. I got a Wii. <laughs> Yo, Wii. Wii's are great. I got a GameCube. Wii is universal. I feel like anyone yeah. could have a Wii. a Wii. Speaking of universal, I have a question for you. Yeah. <clears throat> if a security guard were to. <laughs> <laughs> is this like a riddle? Oh boy. Where's this going? Is this a riddle? Sir is behind the camera and he is dying right now. <laughs> I said it earlier today. Oh. If a security guard works at Samsung, Samsung. does that mean he's the guardi- guardian of the galaxy? <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of funny. Uh, I, if, I, if I was a security guard at Samsung, I think I would go by that title. Yeah, 100%. What, what's your occupation on the Guardian of the Galaxy? Yeah, that's like, it's so funny. <laughs> that is funny. It's so funny. Where'd you see that? And it says the blind. Is that, is that from the dome? I love that. Yeah, because now you saw it on TikTok. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> it's it's <just> <laughs> um, it says a blind. Mm-hmm. Um, she's been like, so well, she's blind. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Oh, we're starting off hot. I'm we sorry. haven't even talked to. I mean, I feel like one. I feel like so much has happened since yeah, the we, last time we've recorded. SZA's album came out after the last time we recorded. Okay, so that's a long. It's been on repeat. Ago. I guarantee, right now, it's probably. Or, it's definitely my most listened to since it's come out. Like I've listened to that the most. More than What's I your think. favorite song? Uh, I have a few. And okay. least favorite. Uh, can I? Ooh, can I top three? It's a little. Can I top three it with no order? Yeah. Okay. I love low. <gasps> you have taste. I love low. Yeah, that was so yeah. good. Yeah, that one's so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. I'm so good. I like nobody gets me. Oh my god. It's such a like sorry. a. I'm sorry. We don't like nobody. You're him. And blind is also good. I don't think it's top three for me. Oh, sorry. That's okay. Speak your truth. F two F is nuts. It is, it is nuts. I love her. Yeah. What? Oh <clears throat> but I, I still have a th- three slot. I think uh, I like open arms too. Oh, so good. Open like, arms is good. Are you like a person who like to like sit in the car and listen to sad music even when you're not sad? All the time. I so love sad music. But it's not. Low's not sad. No, low, low is not, not sad. Every time I listen to low, I feel like I have like a platinum bust down. I also love like, SOS. Like I think that one's so good. Just because like yeah. Seek and destroy. Seek and destroy is good. Mm-hmm. Conceited love language. Bitch, my little name whole album. Oh, they're all. I, I literally they're when I first listened to it, I didn't skip so any of them. I will say I'm not a fan of F2F. It was different. It reminded me of like Hannah Montana. It's different. Yeah. 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 I think it took me back to days that I didn't want to go back to. Closet. Uh yeah maybe you're right. It's okay. My God. No you went you went you through like so a, right. we talked about like My Chemical Romance you went through like right right right. right. I got rocks dude. <gasps> Me too. This, this was the, the hearing her do it was not something I think I was ready for. <laughs> yeah, but I, I honestly liked when I love an artist tries something so different. Yeah, and, like try to go to a different. Yeah, it was different for her, but it, I thought she hated it. She, she did. did. She and, and you know what? I think she's so talented. Maybe like the women in the back of the head. I think she's so talented. I listen like I drive a lot. I love driving. Do you like driving? I hate driving. Really? Yeah, because I'm mean, like I'm just driving. Okay, so when do you listen to your music? When I take a bath, or I want to go to the gym. Fine. Yeah. 
Do you listen? To, like, what kind of music do you listen to in the gym? Um, this is a. This is like. You know, this is like this a good is, question. I think this is like this could be a conversation. This can go anywhere. Yeah. I feel like you know, a lot of people can't always answer this. Like. Um. Honestly, I listen to the same five songs at the gym. Shut down from Blackpink, then Pink Venom, and then I do 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 remix, and then okay. I do um catching, or no 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 no, it's like something told me to. I'm a Blackpink fan, I'm sorry, what can I say? And then I started doing this thing where I listen to motivational speakers when I'm at the gym. Like who? Just like random videos I search up on YouTube and how I'm feeling that day. And I'll like push me to like keep going. Like TED Talks? No, like kind of like words of affirmation. Where it's like, you got this, keep going, push harder. And I'll be just I'll be running fast. So it's like you just spot it. Does it not take you out at all ever? Mm-mm. Mm. Mm-mm. Someone you should listen to. That I love. He's not He's, a, he's I, I think he's considered a motivational speaker, but he just has like a lot of good like TED talks and just like everything. And then Simon Sinek. I've never heard of him. I love him. Simon Sinek. I'll put you on. Okay. He's just like he starts talking. And he's just so he just like. Is he like a comfort like listener for you? I think so. Eh. No, I don't really have like a comfort. Like I'm not a huge podcast guy. I tried. I really tried getting into a podcast phase, and I listened to a few, and I was just like, oh, I just rather listen to music. Yeah. I mean, I don't. I feel like that's like such a weird thing to like sit in your car and listen to somebody talk. Yeah. It's not my thing. Yeah. But I can listen to Emma Chip and talk forever. I, I did. Say that. Anything goes is great. It's I, so good. Yeah. That's a comfort one. Definitely. Literally, I'll be like doing dishes too. and I'll like put it on. I'm like. Yeah. And I feel like everything she talks about is so relatable. <laughs> she talks to me and I'm like talking back to her. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you ever feel like you're sad and you're like, yeah. 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 yeah I'm like, oh my God. Did she move to Spotify yet? I think so. I think so. I'm not yeah. sure. Yeah. Good for bag, yeah. huge bag, huge. Bag. Um, but I, yeah, no, I love <clears throat> listen. I, I love sad music, and I know like people are against that. Like, don't listen to sad music when you're happy. Like, it'll bring you like, I don't know, something about like singing a sad song in the car and getting in the car. Like, ugh, yeah, I feel like rejuvenated. But like, well, so like you can sit there and listen to sad music. The lyrics do not make you sad. You just are. No, I just genuinely enjoy the music. Interesting. I don't think too much into it. Interesting. Like, so, I, like, <laughs> I don't let the lyrics consume me. That's actually interesting. But I love, I, I just, I feel like if I want to like sing, I can't like, I feel like sad songs are the best to, to like sing, you know? Yeah, that's true. Like, you know what one of my favorite songs to this day is? Mm-hmm. Running Low by Sean. Okay. Like, oh, so good. I love it. Running low by Sean Mendes. Okay, I was like Sean. Yeah, Big Sean. No, <laughs> yeah, like, no. Sean like, Sean. But like, <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, love that song. But yeah, I don't know. I love that music. But I also love, like, I've been kind of in my alter alternative indie. Things? No, no, I haven't. You really pulled up with eyeliner. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, not like that. But more like, I don't know. Cigarettes after sex. You know, Ooh. like Arctic Monkey. Okay. Like, uh, have you listened to 1975 yet? Duh. <gasps> Not duh. Yeah, I love 1975. Pop your shoes. Favorite song, go. Uh, Pick up. Speak up. Robbers. <gasps> Pick up your shoes. Why? I don't know why. why? <laughs> <laughs> Take them off. Take them off. <laughs> Hand them over. I love it. I think that's a basic one, though. It but there's, there's like a reason it's basic, right? It's, like, yeah, it's good. Like, this is amazing. Like, have you listened to, um, <clears throat> let me speak up with my chest. Have you listened to um, Falling? By the Robbers, or or by nineteen seventy five. Falling for you? I love Falling by his style, but I have. I, I don't think I'm done Falling. Like who does it? By nineteen seventy five. So good. Did you know Harry? When he wrote Falling, he wrote that song in twenty minutes. I thought he was gonna say he was falling. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. He, I saw. I saw he, an was he talked about it. And he said that he was he was like fresh <clears> out of the shower <throat> and like had his bath towel on and everything and went over to his friend playing the piano and like he was like play that again and then 20 minutes he's insane yeah he's our and that's like one of my favorite songs so it's he's like, definitely our modern day like oh what the fuck was that what do you think it, who are you gonna say Wait, you just like dirt at me no it was one of these oh it's like yeah i not throwing shit um what, who, what was i gonna say yeah who do you think he's like the modern day definitely. i think there's a lot of Thank Jesus you. Christ, but oh, uh, oh, yeah. oh, that's not right. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say we're on the same page, like Elton John or like Elvis Presley. Oh, I mean, yeah, Elvis, Elvis was he was not as big as Harry, he didn't have that many followers. Oh, that's crazy. You just said that. Okay, you're gonna get <laughs> <laughs> all the old heads are gonna eat you up. Don't clip it. There, 
Have you seen Elvis, like the movie? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm missing out. You are. How good is it? Really Austin good. Austin killed it. Really? Austin yeah. Butler. I might have to check out. that role. But in the movie, it, it like said that in one night, he, he did a <clears> show <throat> that like, it was like one of the first ever broadcasted, like streamed shows. Mm-hmm. I don't even know how they did it back then. But basically, if you were in Europe, you could watch this show that he performed, you know, like how streaming is nowadays. Yeah. But it was like a live show that anyone around the world could watch. Guess how many people watched it? Um, like in one night. Guess how many people like tuned in to watch it? I'm going to say like a good like 2 million. 70. 70 million? I'm going to say 70. Is he locked in? I don't have the... It, it's in the billions. There's no way. I swear no. To God. There's I swear no to way. God. How nuts is that? Elvis? Elvis. What? Billions. Look it up. Should, should Get I on live stream. <laughs> <laughs> hey like, guys. that's insane. Insane. Like, I don't think that'll ever happen again. I'm ever. Just because there's so many other. Like, Elvis Presley was the. <clears throat> he was the, like, rock star back then. The I can see that. Though. Like, oh, 1.5 billion fans tuned into one show. Like, how nuts is that? That's. That's real. That's unheard of. Like, I don't think there's anything going to be like that ever again. His most Aloha from show. Hawaii special, where he performed a live show. And over, it was aired in over 40 countries and was seen by 1.5 billion viewers. Jesus, wow. that's insane. That's insane. That's, insane. that's, like, like, that's at like, that time, too. Oh, my God. It's like looking at Justin Bieber's, like, baby video now. Right. If anyone, if anyone had, had a TV or any kind of, like, thing to tune in, they, like, yeah, they, they did. Yeah, they definitely tune in. I don't yeah. know one song by Elvis, though, which is crazy. No, you do. You yes, definitely know some of Can you guys give me an example? What's that one that uh, Doja did? Uh, she interpolated. No, why'd you just say oh, it? Oh, fuck. I'm not going to say it. I still don't know what you guys are talking about. Oh, shit. Um, you ain't nothing but a hound dog. Mm-hmm. You don't know that? <gasps> what about... Oh, I'm not going like, to get into it. Falling in, in love. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's all That's a classic. Yay. He's got... What's that Lilo and Stitch one? <clears throat> oh... No, he didn't do a Hawaiian roller coaster ride. I don't know. I just work here. He has a lot. I'm gonna play. Jailhouse Rock. Wow, what a song that Lilo. Suspicious Minds. Obviously, yeah, so many. Blue Velvet yeah. Shoe. Oof. Oh, we gotta. Yeah, educate. we can't. Yeah, you're getting all these names, but I'm I'm here. My head is shut down with black pink in my head. But <laughs> yeah, he's he's just great. But Harry is definitely like he's up there. He is exactly. killing it. 2022 was Harry's year. It definitely was. What a year. The fact that he played the forum that many times. Yeah. And well, Madison Square Garden. Yeah, I know, like, like his, his, his name will forever be there. As it should be. Like, that's nuts. Be. He has a band in there. That's sick. I'm so mad that I didn't go to Harry Halloween, though. Proud moment. <laughs> to Harry Wink? Yeah. Well, he's got some shows coming up here in LA. But it's like, I can't dress up for that. No, you I'm can. A banana. People wear anything to those shows. Yeah. It's like a free space. It's <laughs> such a comfy space. Those shows, anyone will wear anything. Like, I had two friends go um, yeah. to that show, Christelle, and I think it was Brittany Broski. No, it was Emmy. They dressed up as pigs, and, they, and Harry noticed. Them. Cute. Yeah. yeah. It was cute. Like they go blow up a fatal pig. That's thing. awesome. We should definitely do that. We should dress like a pickles or something. I don't know what exact dates his shows are here in LA, but I, I watermelon. Be... <gasps> watermelon. <gasps> He does a thing where if you dress like, if you dress up as a banana, he'll do something. I know that. And it's like a little. Should we do it? I don't know if I can go to the shows, which sucks. Why can't you go? Cause I leave. I'm gone 13th to the 20th. For your movie? Mm-hmm. Where are you going? Fashion week. Oh, that's fine. Oh. Yeah, Milan and Paris. So yeah. like. Sure, I'd rather be at a Harry show than. Imagine. <laughs> 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 no. <laughs> no, I. Obviously, I'm like gone for a good reason, but like, mm-hmm. I do wish. Yeah. I, I don't know. Maybe there'll be one like in the late twenties, and maybe I'll be there. Like yeah. late twenties, as in January, like late January that I can go to. But I, I think the dates are in the smack middle of January, which yeah. is when I'm going, which sucks. Jesus. I mean, then you're still gonna have a fun time in fashion like that. Definitely. I'll definitely send you videos. I go. Huh? I'll keep you updated. Oh. I'll send you some videos. Oh. Yeah. yeah. No, please do. Me and Sarah though. Drop us like watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> Please do. Um, oh wait, what was I gonna say? How was your Christmas? Right, I was, was gonna Christmas say Christmas, New Year's. Yeah, you went back to Arizona for your. I went back to Arizona for like two and a half holidays. How was that being with like your family? It's the longest break I've had in like 
I think that was the longest time I've been home in five years. Jesus. Yeah. You've been two weeks? A week. Two and a half. Like, two almost three weeks. Jesus. Yeah, but, like, when I went to college that one year, like, even my, even my winter break then wasn't that long. Mm-hmm. And then when I was in Utah for, like, the residency academy, like, I never had that much time at home. So it's been, oh. like, six... Was it, like, a good feeling? So nice. Yeah. Like, I, there was times where... I would get in my own head, I'm like, oh, I'm so bored. And I'm like, wait, this is good that I'm bored. Because yeah. I'm like, when am I ever really bored when I'm like living this life over Especially here? Especially with like, you, your sisters were there too now. So, I, like my mom was in heaven, it was, she had the full house. Cause like, kids. yeah, we're all out of the house now. But like, it was it was really nice just kind of being at home. Was Tyler there? Tyler was there. Yeah, I love Tyler. Tyler, if you're watching this, I miss you. He does watch this, I hope you know that. Yeah. He sent me the clip last time. He sent me a clip of us saying something about you uh, something about you saying that Tyler gets no play and he was, <sighs> and I was like Tyler I didn't mean that and I was like wait I, Tyler, I didn't mean that <laughs> and I said something like if I was like, you asked me if I oh would you put out was a girl yeah like would I like help a homie out and I was like yeah I'd let Tyler hit yeah like yeah I would too and you're like cause you know he's getting no play and he was like fuck y'all <laughs> I didn't mean that and then from a yeah. very dark place, Tyler. I'm sorry if you're watching this. Mm-hmm. But I feel like Tyler calls bitches. Tyler's great with words. Not like that. Like, he's just a great people person. It's like Beethoven. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's just like... Yeah, he's, he's just a really good people person. Like, he's very outgoing. I know, he's very sweet when I met him. Yeah, very popular guy. Is he? And well, everyone just loves him. Like, I don't think I've ever met someone that's like... Hated that Tyler guy. He has like that personality that just kind of. He's like, just, just fun. Like, yeah. He's like grabs. He's a great time. He is a great time. Do you I have to? I'm having up too much now. <laughs> do you have to uh, like ask your sisters a bunch to help with TikToks, or are they always down? Uh, I mean, it's usually the other way. It's usually Tatum annoying me because like when I'm at home, like I don't really want to unless something just like comes to me or if I see something, I'm like, yeah, this looks fun. I'll do it right now. But I'm not like at home like okay family time like when am I ever with my family like I need to make videos with them it's more like I don't know if it happens it happens but right. Tatum's more like calculated when it comes to like alright Noah's home I have this audio saved for us I have this and I'm like Tatum right, she's trying to grind she, yeah. she's trying to be the next she's funny it's a little TikTok star but yeah it's nice like that normalcy at home and like seeing friends that I haven't seen in a while was always so nice played a lot of soccer which was fun that's good yeah it's good to be around your family Where'd you go? Um, I had my family come to my house. So How was that? It was so nice. My mom, my grandma. I think, were you here too? Mm-hmm. Yeah, services flight, so you stuck me for Christmas, which is nice. Um, <laughs> Sir, we, where were you supposed to go? I was supposed to go home. My flight got delayed. Where'd you, where's home? Seattle. I knew that. You did. Wait, it got <clears throat> delayed. You know how, like, hella people were, like, getting their flight canceled? Yeah. Were you on Southwest? <clears throat> no, Alaskan. Oh. Yeah. And it just got, like, canceled. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yeah, so you stuck with me. But what, which is an amazing Christmas, though. I had a great time. My mom, my I brother, and my um, grandma came to the house. I had Arrington <laughs> come over as well. Yeah. Just, he didn't go to Christmas, and his family didn't celebrate this year, so he still, like, stayed with us. And Sir helped me pick out everyone presents. Um, I did an amazing job this year. And we just, like, stayed. We kind of just stood at my house, and then we had breakfast the next morning. Wholesome. It was cute. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. And it was just really nice, because I don't really spend time with my family that much. So now I'm like actually putting the effort to like allow them in my life and yeah. do things with them. And it's been really nice. That's good. Yeah. And I love spending Christmas with your best friends is always the best too. Was mm-hmm. there any like family drama? Mm-mm. It's good. It was just like got PJs from grandma. I was like, <laughs> cutest thing ever. I was like, I'm what? She has cute PJs. That's my grandma cute. got me yeah, so many PJ socks guy. too. It was so nice. Socks are always, like, I think the practical gifts, like when you get older, become so much more like valuable. Mm-hmm. Like there's so much, <clears throat> I don't know. Like if I would have got socks and underwear when I was a kid, like, a kid up. what? Yeah, but now, now yeah, it's like, oh. I'm like, period. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I love good Calvin Klein underwear, so if y'all want to, if you guys want to donate, <laughs> give them over. We're giving you my underwear. You. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 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 you want to hear a fun story? Oh, no. Show tell the funny story about the um. Turn the camera to Noah. That's underwear. Yeah. Okay, so I had a friend stay at my house, right? Well, right. Kind of friend. Um, speaking of underwear. 
had a friend stay at my house. Um, he showered in my guest bathroom, mm. and I had to go pee, but someone was in my bathroom using the bathroom. Yeah, so after we finished showering, I went into the guest bathroom to pee. As I'm peeing, I see his, <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> I see his underwear on the floor, and I didn't look, I didn't really think anything of it. But then I, I look a little closer, and I see it. shit stains, bitch. And not just normal shit stains, I'm talking like shit streaks. Like he's not, he hasn't washed his ass since like the dinosaur days. So then, oh, I, I leave him there, no. I'm not gonna touch your shitty underwear, I'm sorry. So I leave him there and I go back in um, my room and I tell sir, and he doesn't know that we know that his underwear has shit stains, cause like, it's embarrassing, we're not gonna make fun of you for that. But the thing, like, oh, my how old how is this kid? <laughs> he's like 20. Okay. And the thing that was it so It might be funny, best to tell him, like, you gotta wipe your ass. Yeah, like no. The thing that had me and Sir dying was when he left, he goes, oh, fuck, I left my underwear. Larry, don't wear them. Because mm. he didn't know there was shit things in it. Right. Like, don't flatter yourself. I'm not going like, they're actually going in the furnace after. <laughs> oh. And then we're like, you were so And he was like, what's so funny? <laughs> <laughs> it was so funny. Yeah, then you, you wore them. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Then you I actually right when you left. I'm actually working right now. <laughs> what about it? Oh! I think I'm just a nasty, like, ghoul, huh? Ghoul? Yeah, you think I'm just like a fucking, like, I'm a muck. No. Muck is such a good word. Me and Sir did this thing. I, you might as well give him this podcast, shit. No, bro, you gotta Um, Me and Sir did this thing. Have you ever seen, like, Disney Channel? You know how, like, they have, like, the, the insults for Super Boring? So mm-hmm. it's like. Yeah. What, what, the over the top me? words. Yeah. As if. Yeah, yeah. Or like, uh. <laughs> Let's try some good ones. <laughs> Say all the time. What's my. Oh, we've been saying. Oh my god. Beat it, moron. <laughs> yes. Beat it, moron. <laughs> or I go, shut up, doofus. Oh it's so funny. <laughs> one way ticket to loser belt. <laughs> <laughs> 2023, we're not cursing out people, we're just choosing that. That's funny. Okay, so try it. I love it. I'm, I'm, we're, we're fighting, right? Okay. And I'm like, you're a stupid bitch. What are you gonna say to that? Nigga. <laughs> 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 no no sense oh at the same time. I'm like, oh, why? Uh, like, I don't know. Oh, I think I just used God. all of them. <laughs> like, I can't, I'm not like quick Deep enough. Deep harder now. Really put that brain to you. Okay. Like, think. Close your eyes. Now, because you said it, I can't stop thinking of like, moron, doofus, loser. Yeah. Yeah, yeah those are good. Stinky. Stink. Ah, oh, oh stinky's God. good. The biggest, <laughs> we talked about this. There's nothing you can say that can hurt my feelings. But if I'm arguing with somebody, they call me either a loser. Okay. Oh, it's a wrap. I'm done. I lost. Or, oh, you, you don't like lame either. I did that one night. Oh, I hate it. Like, like, you're talking to It's just, I don't know, it's like a it's mean like your name. name. You're just like, someone be like, you're a loser. Oh, that's yeah. sad. It hurts. That hurts. Yeah, or like someone it's saying, like, you're nothing, <gasps> you're nothing to me. You're nothing to me is a lot. It's a lot. They don't mean that. Of course not. But That's like, a deep dig. I know. Sir so like says it all the time. That's deflecting. <laughs> sir does it all the time. Every time I'll say anything, sir, he'll go, you're nothing. <laughs> okay, go, no, it's a joke. <laughs> <laughs> you just tell your asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I was ice Sir was blacked out one day. Sorry to spill your beans like this, but belligerently blacked out. Okay. And I was trying to be a good friend in like, like, I was saying something to him, like, to benefit him. Right. Wait, was that on the couch? It was, you're far away, and I screamed, I go, sir. I kept seeing, I was like, sir, fuck. And I was screaming loud, I was like, sir. And he goes, you're nothing. <laughs> Out of nowhere. <laughs> and that was it. And he went to bed. <laughs> That's well, sad. Not today. Wait, so, the uh, argument on the couch, that, I feel like that was my biggest, like, moment. When? <clears throat> my moment. <laughs> when you were telling me not to go to the club with the boys, I sounded like a Karen yeah. in that video. What did I say? That was a lie. Um. Oh. Because <laughs> he was filming me, and I didn't want to be filmed. And he's like, gaslight. Like, he's like, I'm not filming you. <laughs> and he was filming. And then what did I say? <laughs> I was like, he's like, stop talking. And I was like, I don't have an attitude. Seems like you do. <laughs> and it's just like that. <laughs> like, actually, I was like, seems like you do. But the face is not exactly I just blacked out. <laughs> Oh my gosh. That's so funny. Speaking of, speaking of like, you said, 
or that's what we're not going to do in 2023 is cuss people out. Mm -hmm. We should go through our do's and don'ts or like ins and outs. I'm down. Okay. You want me you after this break? piss break? Can I please go pee? I got yeah. That was a perfect. That was such a good transition. Oh, okay. Oh. All right, right back into it. Here we go. Um. Wait. Where's my drink? Oh, I fucking went to the bathroom. Okay. Back. Have you have do you, have you been seeing like I, I've seen some people on like Instagram post it in like a dump of like ins and outs and they're actually quite funny. I haven't seen anything about it. Oh. Um, well, it's just like really random things that are like in and, and then like what's out. Like, go give me an example. I don't know. Give me an example of yours. Like one of my ins? Yeah. No, because you know me. I'm going to try to like take, I'm not going to take it too serious. You don't take it serious. But you're like funny. So like you'll do like the funny ones. I'll do like the serious. Why like, can we both Guys, be... this is in for 2023. <laughs> I'll match yours. I want to try to find an example. Yeah. Because they're, they'll make sense. And, um, like... Here, I would say ins for me, um, books, outs, mm, vapes. Good one. That was great. I just that was great. Everyone's great. vape addiction. So you guys yeah. are welcome. Thank you guys so much. Who is this? She's so pretty. I think she had a good in and out. Something over her. Good in. <laughs> <Get in. laughs> Let's get into it. Yeah. So, like, yeah, it, it can be funny, like, in topping, out bottoming. Whoa. You know? Me last All the games. I totally, I totally thought, like, toppings for, like, ice cream and stuff like that. I, I love oh. toppings. <laughs> you love toppings? Yes. Which, which, yeah, like, I love, like, what? That's what I said. Oreos. On, yeah. yeah. Or, like, cookie dough or like, oh. brownie batter. You like them brown? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, sorry, it just had to come out. Like, like said, so where twisted and devious, you can be locked away. Like M and M's, you know, like that kind of thing. Okay, how about this? Ends. Sushi. Out. Sushi's so in. You love sushi. Yeah, for me now. I just started eating fish. I used to be so against fish. Literally, I just started. Why do I not fish. remember that? I feel like you've always liked sushi. I, but I would get like an avocado roll and I'd be like, yeah, let's go get sushi. Like, Duh. I bet you're eating avocado and cucumber. Yeah. But now I started eating like, you know, like. California roll. Add, add the crab. <laughs> no, I'm allergic to California. What? <laughs> NASA. I'm, I'm allergic. <laughs> <laughs> Why is NASA so against LA? And says, so like, where's Gina gonna go? Oh my God. Why, why? why are you not in jail? You just killed your ex. I know. And his girlfriend? I, know. I forgot about Kill Bill. So okay. Okay. Yeah, We forgot about that one. Okay. But back to our ADHD, she's crazy. I just started eating um, fucking like, what is it? Yellowtail sashimi on? Yeah. I never used to eat that. Like albacore and mm -hmm. like, you know, we just got put on. I started yellowtail. eating tuna too. I've never been a tuna. tuna fish. I hate tuna if it's like, like canned tuna, I can't do it. Oh, but if it's like crispy rice tuna, oh my god. Oh, god. Mm. Tuna what was that? Right? What was that back there? I'm oh, fucking a tuna fish sandwich from the can. Oh, I can't. Yeah. I can't do it. I can't do it. I feel like a cat. Reggie? <laughs> I was. <laughs> you know what my order from Subway is? I think, one of, I think one of the greatest things I've ever. That's gross. I don't. I, think one of the, you. I, I don't really don't. do like Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you like them. <laughs> Um, I think one of the greatest things I've ever put in my mouth is <laughs> stop. Is wow. a catch roll? No, is from Catch LA mm -hmm. the crispy rice. I've like, never had it. It's the greatest thing ever. It's literally like a little crispy rice patty, like a little rice mm -hmm. rectangle. Stop, and then uh, it's like a little tuna thing with like spicy mayo Ooh, on top. It's insane. Good. I insane. flick off the jalapenos though. Wow, it's too spicy. Because it comes with jalapenos. I hate jalapenos. Is ketchup spicy to you? Ketchup? Mm -hmm. No. Should it be? Uh, I'm sorry. Might be expired if it's spicy. Really? Like spicy ketchup. Are you? Do you that could be good. Wait, no, I've had spicy ketchup from like Dialogue. Fire. Dialogue Cafe is kind of fire. What's your deal? <laughs> <laughs> like, what's your... <laughs> There's... <laughs> There's literally nothing. Spicy ketchup. This I'm trying is, to like, think I of, haven't like... seen you in so long, so like I'm trying to adapt to you. Mm. Imagine being around Star all day. So the way we talk, it's <laughs> such a good time. Yeah, it's an amazing time. But the way we talk is not help me in no <laughs> time. Different time. Oh, yeah, I'm adapting right now. Yeah. This is the first time we talked in like it's a while. two weeks, three weeks. Um, don't keep it on D and D. 
No, it hasn't. I just wasn't on my phone. It's okay. Mm. What? Huh? I blacked out. I said, like, <laughs> did we do it? It was a mess. The past, like, 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 the past, like, mess. Can we start from the top? Over holiday. Yeah, I was yeah. just like, <laughs> okay, hey, you guys, what's up? Welcome back to Put a Sock in the Pocket. What? Did you know that? <laughs> Huh? Camilla, how has your Christmas been? Great. Is it amazing? It's announced. It's 2023. Let's go. Wait, this is crazy. I have never been this, like, lost. I, I don't I'm having a hard time. I feel like if we had... Here, let's, I, but let's, I, let's I, get creative. I do actually have one that I can show you guys. In, traveling. Okay. So in. So in. For Thanks. Out, matcha. You ate. That was real. That was real. I just don't like matcha. I don't know if, like, that was really cool. Grass, water... Thing. So out. It's like it's there's healthier things. There's more enjoyable things. He likes matcha, huh? Yeah. Yeah, he loves <laughs> matcha's not good though. And it, uh, Ooh. Okay, thing. here we go. That could spark. Here we go. So like this girl was saying in venting, out complaining. Mm. Ooh, like yeah, in communicating. Oh, oh, that's course. so in. Of course. Should always be in. <clears throat> out passive aggressive. Yeah, yeah I can't stand a passive aggressive bitch. But out, <laughs> out holding stuff in. Am I passive aggressive? Did you say? No, wait. Oh. I literally was just like, am I? No, no I don't think I am. you're not at all. No, you're like the communication. I love everyone. communications. I think out is like holding it all in. Like I feel like yeah. life is so short in terms of like, if you have something to say, just say, say it. it. But like think before you say it. Obviously, like don't, do not just say anything. But like, I don't know. Especially, like, I think one of the biggest things. <clears throat> is I think life is so short in terms of how's your boy? I don't. I was just. I was gonna say something. Oh yeah. <laughs> wait. Because <laughs> I was gonna. Raggy. Wait. Because I was gonna say. <laughs> I was gonna say like life is short to like not tell someone that you like him. And I was like, wait, like him. You have. Huh? Wait. I'm joking. Are y'all good? We're amazing. I, I'm. I'm mentally happy with him. Did he go home? Mm-hmm. Are y'all still? This is crazy. <laughs> I know, like, you just really just dropped the I am sorry. We, we, this can cut all this. I was just, no, I'm we, we, as your friend, I'm curious. Honestly, this is how our brains work. It moves too fast. So, like, mm-hmm. yeah, we're doing amazing. I love that. Yeah. Because life's too short to, like, no, then that's if you didn't like, like, I will say he taught me how to communicate my feelings because I that. used to be very passive aggressive and I, I hate conflict. So, like, if I was upset with you, I wouldn't tell you for a week. And then one day I'll just drop the bomb, which is not. It's not mm-hmm. helping. It doesn't. It just makes everything worse. So, recently, what's ever since I started man. talking to him, he, every time he has a, like an issue or like, he'll be like, "If you, I can tell you're upset. What's wrong? Let's talk about it." And we talk about everything. So now we don't have any issues because we know it's got them immediately. Oh, and also, so. he's patient and I'm patient. So that make you guys stronger too. It definitely does. Wow. I mean, it's good. I well, will say, like, Sir can even vouch for this. I used to be so toxic in a sense, right? So can you vouch for this? Oh my god, I went through hell with this man. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm like, just talk! Yeah, because I was scared of being left, and I also was like, no. Yeah. I just, you know, it's so hard to, like, explain. Like, I don't want to... You also didn't want to hurt him. Yeah, and I don't want to, like, talk about... Like, talking about your feelings is so weird. It is, like, the weirdest thing ever. I'm too comfortable with it, I think. Oh, well, we're different. Yeah. You know? And I'm learning how to do it, and I'm, I got so good at it. But you have to also, like, keep your cards kind of close, depending yeah. on who you're talking to. That is very true. I sometimes don't. I kind of like show people my cards too much sometimes. Well, you need to start. Like we just met. You want to hear about like my love life? I mean, but that's like a comforting yeah. thing, though. But you're out. Your out is not revealing so much, maybe. Yeah, an your out in is... is keeping things to yourself. Yeah, like communicate, I guess, but like, also. I think an in is like protecting yourself and like keeping yeah. your guard up, but like not too much. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. like I love love, and you know this, and that's why like I like hearing about it, because like. I don't know, like, even when I am not in love, it's like, yeah. I like hearing about other people's kids. Yeah, it's definitely yeah. a good feeling. Yeah. Another in that she wrote that I thought was good, watching movies in the theater, another out, watching movies on your phone. People watch movies on their phone? That's That's been out for me. That's been out? 2023 that's never been that that's, I hope that's not a thing. No, unless yeah. you're, like, on a flight, but then even then, if you're on an actual, like, flight that's going far enough to... They have watch screens. a movie. Yeah, they have screens. Like, right. It's like a... Not spirit. Why are you looking at me like that? It was like first class. No! That's <laughs> no, 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 like, what I meant. If you're in economy, like, watch it on your phone. Economy, <laughs> economy's hot. Economy <laughs> has screens. Yeah, yeah. If it's like a LA to New York type thing. Yeah. Yeah. Some planes. Yeah. JetBlue. Yeah, yeah. 
That's yeah. yeah that's definitely oh like I. I think movie theaters in. Going to the movie theaters should be in. I mean, definitely. I think that's way more fun than like watching a movie at home. The full experience. Mm-hmm. What I think is, I'm I'm gonna start saying things that are in just like for me. This doesn't have to apply to you guys, but like my ins. So we're basically doing like a shortened like resolution type thing. Okay. In. Uh, mm. I would say in for me is. Jorts. Ooh, okay. Like, I like jorts. Yeah, in in or jorts. I'll say right, yeah. this. I'm so sorry. It's been do you know who Kevin Gates is? I do know Kevin Gates. He wears these tight ass skinny them. jeans yeah. with this belt and it's like always sagging. You're talking about gangster rapper Kevin Gates? Yeah. Yeah. A lot of people are trying to bring skinny jeans back in. Like even fashion people are trying to bring like them back it's, in. Like, yeah, if you I think if it's done well, away, yeah. it's like, but just, they're not exactly like timeless. I think like a... Like that though is not okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's not okay. You know he got those at Hot Topic. He's yeah. sagging because he can't. Maybe he got those from pull Jesus him up house. any higher. <laughs> he went to Little Honey House and grabbed those and said, "Okay, we're going on stage." I don't think he's that's funny. Kevin Gates is hilarious. Is he? He's just like the he stuff was, he's been saying now is just so meme worthy. Like he's <laughs> the Duke of That is very. It's, 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 it's a lot. Uh, I would say inner those shoes. Outer so Air Force Ones. Yeah, some of them are very trendy. Yeah, what are some fashion trends that are out for you? Um, Oof, a lot. What's your own? I, really sure. I would say... Let's get like nit gritty, like little things that are just out, like don't do them. Okay. Chokers? Uh, I think chokers are hard. I would say... Out, okay. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry, you... Sounds like you like, like American... In, what is it? American Crombie? What is that shit called? Abercrombie? 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 Crumble cookie. <laughs> Bitch, I will leave. I will walk out right out. <laughs> um, I would say in for guys. I would love when guys like you know where. Um, yeah, it's different than it? some girls. Like, huh? Yeah, I was about to say like my ins and outs are gonna be different for the guys on the other side. I think it's so nice when guys like kind of like wear like dangly earrings and stuff. Okay. Because a lot of them don't. A lot of them just have to wear studs. I think that's pretty much okay. Ooh, yeah. Did you ever get your ears pierced? I would. I can see you with them. But I, yeah, I don't know. I've like fought, fought this in my head for a while, and then like I forget about it, and then I come back to it, and I go through a phase. I'm like, should I? It's yeah, fun. I just never do. It's fun. Yeah. I can see it. Or yeah. like a nose pierce. I've always kind of wanted to get my nose pierced, but it's just yeah. like wouldn't feel like me. I don't know. Well, kind of get that get that out of your head. Yeah, you, you can know, make it you. Sure. Yeah. Exactly. Don't be afraid. Ooh, and shoelace has a belt. Trying shit that no. you would never try. Alex walking on eggshells and not doing and exploring things. Yes. Say one. that one more time. What? Oh. I'm confused. You know, my brain's so fast, I forgot what I said. Um, ends stepping out of your comfort zone and doing things you would never usually do. Alex being closed off and not trying shit and just yeah. like doing things you're used to. Closed minded, so out. So I hate closed-minded people. I hate them. So like, if you want to eat like learn. Ass. I guess. Yeah. 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 I mean, you can be. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. What? What? We're being weird now. But I think. <laughs> but I think. Uh, oh, that's some. Like, what is something that you always wanted to try but you? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. What are you doing? <laughs> Please, shut up. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Shut the fuck up and stop thinking like that. Because my question was a great question and it would have been see very educational for our viewers, but you all gonna make it some gay shit. I didn't do anything! <laughs> You're my cold person. You're nothing to me. <laughs> there it is. Um, what is something you all want to try that you've been scared of? Like fashion or like even just like a sport or like, you know, anything. Yeah, anything. Uh... <laughs> And then I get hate. For I want. I want to. I think I want to skydive this year. Ooh, that's that's like one. so like cliche. I mean, like, that's very. Yeah, that that's... like came to mind. It's like something I haven't done. Like I've, I'm like I'm fortunate that I've done like a lot of really cool things, but like I still just haven't skydived. Like I haven't done that, which okay. would be fun. Like I, I will continue to travel. I love traveling. Let's do um, appearance stuff. What? Did you ever dye your hair? Or like 
Oh, oh, did it mix up my look? Yeah. Yeah. Right, like, that's Should I edge it up a bit? Yeah. 2023? Mm-hmm. What about blonde? A little pop of blue for the kids' choice award. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nobody know that me. <laughs> Wait, no, who, I was going to say, say who's done that? Selena Gomez. Selena. A pop of blue for the kids' choice award. Sorry. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think, come on. <laughs> oh, God. A little it. pop of blue. <laughs> I need to know. Blue going on. Where's that inspiration coming from? I don't know. I like a little edge and a little pop in my hair, so I wanted to add something different, especially for the Teen Vogue party. <laughs> I love this Teen Vogue party. <laughs> <laughs> I love rare beauty. That was iconic. I love rare beauty. Oh my god. Wow. Dude, I love her. I was Can thinking of the video of Demi Lovato farting. <laughs> <laughs> Just for uh, my own personal reasons. It was, is that real? Yes. That was real. <laughs> Legend says she's still farting to this day. Swear to god this is real. <laughs> That's not real. Nice <laughs> shots! <laughs> That when that first came out, I was like, "What?" <laughs> I thought it'd be real. Um, have you done skydiving? I meant to ask. Yeah, I have. Have you skydived? I s- <laughs> skydive. This was in the phase of like I always saw my breath stinked because I had braces on, so I chewed gum twenty four seven. In the plane, I forgot to spit on my gum, so I jumped and the gum went in my throat. Oh, was that scary? Were you oh. choking? Oh yeah, I had a panic attack midair. midair. I thought I was gonna faint. <laughs> you said, and the guy behind That's me looked. Scary. So you have to skydive with an instructor. Right. The guy behind me seemed so bad. Oh. So bad. He was all over my goodies. Oh. Yeah, I was like <laughs> the gully of stuff. <laughs> <Cool>. <laughs> it was a lot. You should definitely skydive though. I, I think I yeah I want to because I yeah that sounds fun. What about like I'm saying like you know bleach your eyebrows one day. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. You think that's that. weird? I'm just not behind that. You like the freaks? No. <laughs> no, I, I like obviously like I I actually, there's been guys that have done it, but mostly I've been seeing girls do it, and it's like yeah, it's different. It's camp. Oh. Say it, camp. I don't know if I want to. What What does this mean? That's like that's so camp. It was yeah, like, I a know. theme at the Met. Yeah, it's like it's like this kind. Yeah, it's a kind. It's I feel like I'm getting no. no I'm you're being good. You're good. I'm just smiling. Camp is like a, isn't it like a British term? A lot of people in like the UK use it. I'm not Central C. I don't know. <gasps> don't talk about my man. I love Central C. Me too. I don't know. He's chill or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> what does camp mean? It describes some behavior for females. It is exaggerated and amusing, often in a way that is thought to be typical of some. Male homosexuals. No. What are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I didn't know that last part. I didn't know that last part exists. Um, Typical of some it's men. Not what it's, like. it's not what it's being. It's crazy. We are trendsetters is basically what it means. Oh. I need some more ins and outs. I know. Uh, would, really you, would you rock a runway show? Walk? Yeah. Yeah. You would? I would. It's been in the talks. It sounds so scary to like have to do the walk. Yeah. It is. It's a bit intimidating. Like, when my team wants me to do it, uh, there were a few designers that reached out last year, but I had, they, like, wanted me to, like, the first one to be, like, strategic mm-hmm. in, like, a a way that made sense. Yeah. So. Have you ever practiced walking? I do it every day. Oh, okay. Link. We thought you ate that. You no, serve it all the time. Yeah, just on constantly runway. <laughs> yeah, like, what is your runway? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, when you're on the treadmill, do you, like, no, I don't. No. I, I, I definitely get the cardio in. I remember when I know who you I, I, I know you are. <laughs> oh yeah. She Would walk. you walk? Like in a show? In a show. Probably not. Really? Because I feel like I don't know. I feel like it's not my thing. My like you know, it's not my calling. Yeah. It's definitely not mine either. I don't think. But but it makes sense. For in. Me. No, it's not exactly in. It's just more of like I think one of my things for twenty twenty three is gonna be. Like, why not? 
Like that's like gonna be like one of my sayings this year. Like my mindset this year is gonna give be like, me, why not? Give me an example. An example is if someone's like, you know, you when I do this movie okay. and and we start filming in March, which I'm excited for, and I already know there's gonna be comments of like like why like why is Noah Beck like why like is this movie. TikToker do, doing this? Like he only did this because of that. And it's like why not? Like what like why or like why would he do this? Like why not? Like I have the opportunity. Like you would do it too, mm-hmm. and if you wouldn't, then like we're just different in that way. Because yeah. I want to do everything I can with these opportunities. Yeah. So it's like, I want to try things. Like I want to do things that I just never thought I'd be able to do. So it's like that's the only way you should alive too. Yeah, but I'll also just like have fun. Like if I'm not having fun, I won't do it. But like, eh, that's not true. Sometimes like it's just work, and you have to do it. But it like, it'll be fun to be on set though. Like that. Yeah. That like, right there just sounds overall like a great time. Ultimately, like, like I just like want to just keep having fun. And like the moment that it isn't fun, I just I might have to shift. I'm gonna start living like that. Yeah. Why not? Like why not? I, that's like I think. Why not? Mm. Why not? What's yeah. the problem, dog? Like what's something fun that is just like in this year? In. Okay. Ooh. Game nights. In Addison Ray. Out the hate train. Now hear me out. Love Addison. Mm. Die for Addison. But I personally think she is our 2023 hate girl. Wait, you you started off like love her, but like, what do you mean? I don't know. I, I just felt like it was going in a different direction. Oh no no, no. I'm just saying I love her. So like obviously if I'm gonna, I don't oh, know, like, like she's I'm in. not dick riding, but I do think like she deserves way more. You do love that. I just think she's so cool. And you think love she's Addison. a sweet soul. Me and Sarah love like. Yeah, I got over her last show. She's she, she's like on a different wave, and I love it. Yeah. But that's my end now. She kind of just always doing her own thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And people hate her for it. What do you want do to see that? from her? Like. Another movie, more music. music. Yeah. Oh, I would love to see music. I think she's a she would be like a great performer. Have you ever talked to her about Obsessed? Like, does she mm-hmm. love it? I, w- I would always call her out and be like, you need to drop it to, do that, to die for. Yeah. It's a, it's a gay anthem. Uh-huh. It is. Have you heard To Die For yet? No. Mm-hmm. Another N, I would say. Ooh. Okay, this is controversial. Okay. One picture on Instagram, out photos. T. I can't do that. I can't remember the last time I posted a single photo. But I love a dump. Like, I, I just. It's weird. I really <laughs> set myself up, don't I? <laughs> I, I love. Like, well, it, most of the time, it's not even a dump. It's just like me not being able to decide my first. Like, it's not yeah. me not be able to decide on just one. Mm-hmm. I'll just be like, hey, I'm, I'm like trying to stop doing dumps, though. That means you gotta take less photos, I think. I think. I know, but dumps are fine. So. I know, because when I have a friend take, like, photos for me, mm-hmm. or, like, if I like, take photos for anyone, I spam it. Yeah. And it gives you a lot of options. That's true. And you'll go through, and you're like, I love these four. Mm-hmm. So, just slow down the finger speed, and you'll get one, you think? Okay. Yeah. It's so I hate it. I hate it. Yeah, what's going on? Like, Jesus yeah. Christ! It just it, like in one sentence there was a dump and finger speed, and it was just like a lot of me to handle back here. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, God. Um, yeah, that's that's a good one. I'm just you know. I'm just what do you think? What, do you, what are your okay. stance? What's your stance on reels? Like Instagram reels? I hate them. Okay. Sorry. But no. Was that? I'm out, I'm out of my contract. Oh, yeah. I'm not a fan. Yeah. It gets, I, I love I'm, Instagram, but I just, like, it's just, I think Instagram should just stick to just being for photos. And, yeah. And TikTok is for that. They really of they took over that category of photos. Like, you think post photos online? Instagram. You post videos online? Yeah. TikTok. But now you can post photos on TikTok, too. That's Actually, weird. I don't like that. I hated that TikTok. Did that. <gasps> Maybe that's an in. Or now. Because everyone was kind of following TikTok. And then TikTok kind of was like, we can do dumps, you know? Like, that now they have, like, the post now. I'm not doing that. Post now. It's like that? the be real thing. Oh, on TikTok. Yeah, that's like the the second oh. thing over. Yeah, I, I haven't even looked at that once. I'm... The stories. Ew. Yeah. Who's watching that? No one. You guys ever met someone that does <laughs> Our not TikTok's have TikTok? Getting shadow. I know. <laughs> have you ever met someone that doesn't have TikTok and so they watch basically the TikToks that are current through Reels, but yeah. because of the Reels, they're coming in like a week or two late from when we all saw them. Mm-hmm. Shorts. That's what happened to me. Wait, I don't so know, you that. I don't have I'm glad you mentioned that. My grandma. So you, like you said, the reels are like months past. Yeah. 
or in the past. They come so late. My grandma called me. She was like, this was like three days ago. She was like, is your friend Nikita okay? I just saw she got arrested. <laughs> <laughs> like, that happened so long ago. Yeah. That's crazy. Uh, it was that's like, a yeah. trip. That's that's real strange. Y'all are living in the past. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, I really like the ins and outs. I want to think of a few like quirky ones that are just like random. Yeah. So yeah. Quirky. No, I don't like what that. About, why are you screaming? I don't know. Sorry. Calm down, <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk <laughs> um, um, <laughs> Okay. I can keep giving you some. Okay, let's do. I, I think because these are like trendy at the moment. Stance on AirPods. I'm I'm not like against the them. big headphones. I like them. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it's gold. Do you think they're out? I think they're. I think. They're and do you think like the cute little like Sony or like Madewell or? I never seen anybody with Bose. Sony. You know, mm-hmm. I don't see those. You what do you see, see those at? I see them. Where? I don't know. Just like those like. I've never seen. I don't those. know. I, I, I was just trying to spot oh, the I like the little, I like wired headphones better. Wired? Mm-hmm. Like it just, the it's Apple like, ones? Mm-hmm. I love those. Those are great. You never yeah. lose them. Yeah. AirPods are very easy to lose. Like the little ones. The little AirPods. Mm-hmm. What do you work out in? Like clothes? No. Like, like or like, no, I'm like, like clothes or like, 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 what do you put on your ear when you work oh, out? Oh, um, my AirPods Maxis. Really? Mm-hmm. I've tried working out in them. It's hard. Oh, as, as in like, I feel like they fall, like as comfy as they are, mm-hmm. they kind of fall, like, I don't know, I do a lot of like hip workouts, like I'm like always moving. <laughs> <laughs> like if I'm, I, I, I can't sit still. So like I, I need like little AirPods. Really? Yeah. We are not the same. Because I do more cardio, so. And I yeah. jump rope. So bitch. I saw this one. In low engagement. That's so in. <laughs> <laughs> Who posted this? This is a comedian named Jordan Fistman. Firstman. Yeah, I, I I saw I saw this exact same post. I didn't know who he was. He follows me though. I was like, yeah, king. He has uh, some funny ones. Same hi to mommy and daddy. In. You know I think's out. <laughs> Asking questions. Holding in that cum. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, yeah, that's in. That's being in. selective. Oh, that's dumb. Or celibate. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, <pardon. laughs> but being celibate. Out hiding legs. <laughs> <laughs> you walk away. <laughs> Wait, out ketamine. What? This should have never been in in the first place. Be, what, what's out? Asking questions. Oh. Okay. No question, look it up. <laughs> yeah. Out depression. If you're sad, stop. Yeah, those things are so funny. <laughs> it's like... Aesthetics without deep intention. Out. Do you know as? Oh my god, I'm glad you mentioned this. Do you know what aesthetics actually mean? No. <laughs> Wait, what? Do you know what aesthetics actually mean? Do you know how people be like, oh, I love your aesthetic? You use it, like, it's they use it. You saw Troy. You saw Troy's video. Yeah, H-U-O. H-U-O. <laughs> Why? Wait, what? No, Troy Savon's on gay TikTok. H-U-O. Next one. What was Troy Savon's video? Yeah, I don't mind it there. Like, H-U-O. Like, you know, we can go right shaming now. for the no, gay TikTok. No, 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 I'm not. Now I'm homophobic. Oh, my God. <laughs> no, it's, no, because people are always like, Oh my god, you're so aesthetic. And it's like, uh-huh. that's not how you use it. Like, you either, you're either, like, aesthetically pleasing, or you have a certain aesthetic. Uh-huh. But, like, people use the word aesthetic as, like, an adjective. Right, right, right. Where it's, like, a noun. Yeah, yeah. And he yeah. was just, like, pressed about it. Right. And it was, like, funny. That. Like, kind of funny. I see it. I don't know. But I, I can't lie. I say it. I'm like, oh, you're so aesthetic. Yeah. That's what I was trying to bring up, because we do it. We do it. But you ate me out. Yeah. You saw it take on the <laughs> I see everything. Apparently. Um, you know what's in? Responding quickly to texts. That's that's okay. Mm. Like I think in is just like what's in is ripping off the band-aid and just being straight up with people. Like just yeah. cutting the bullshit and being like, if you can't come to something or if you can't make it just just be like, hey, sorry, I can't. Instead of like because I personally <clears throat> find myself doing that sometimes where I'm like, I feel so bad, I don't know how to say no, so I'll kind of just like assume that me leave and it's like bad and I would just be like hey man sorry I can't make like I'm sure they'll understand Mm -hmm. you know so Alex Flakes that's kind of I need it um okay sorry (laughs) we've been all over the place guys I'm sorry this podcast episode was a little bit unhinged and just all over the place I think hiking's in a little bit I think hiking's in hiking's been in though Hiking's been in. It's been in. Wait, I yeah, that shit never left. Pilates in. 
Pilates is have you done it? Yoga. Oh wait, yeah. Give me a more niche like in right. sort of class, like hot yoga. Okay, okay. Hot what yoga in. I think hot yoga is great. I think yoga itself out. Okay, like, I get that. Boring. Sometimes. Like why? Like why do yoga if you can do hot yoga? Right, right, right. It's the same thing. Yeah, it's yeah. just more purposeful, I guess. Mm. Yeah. Shatak. I think I don't know. I don't know much about yoga. Yeah, but okay. You're I fine. love hot yoga. I did it once and I almost fainted. He kept walking up the room. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> some was like next to him out and he's stretching to see him walking out. Some was get a shit was get a real cruise. No, some, some places <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Some places crank it to dangerous heats. Oh, like, you know, oh, and I'm gonna I'm gonna expose was a high yoga? Was a high eight? I took a fart. <laughs> in that closed room. Oh. Because the bitch said, and we go down and all I hear was I said And that's when I walked out. I said, let me walk, let me go and walk real quick. A <laughs> fart and it's hot too. <laughs> oh, that's a steamy though. Okay, my farts smell like baby powder. Uh-huh. <laughs> You're here. Hey Nassau. In one thing I will shut it. Sir. <laughs> shut it now. Do you prefer running? Do you run? I love running. Do you run on the treadmill or outside? Treadmill. Interesting. I don't. I mean, like you, running, do you want to change that? Do you think running outside I, is in? I, no, oh. I think it's so in, but my social anxiety can I handle that? No, I think for me, I prefer running on a treadmill because, like, I'll see when it hits. Like, okay. One mile. Yeah. Like, yeah. And like on your phone, I guess you can get an app for that. I'm like, you're right. So you have an Apple Watch or something. Yeah. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> but it's like, I, yeah. Also, just like, I don't know. I feel like I, I want to be. You want to be active outside? Well, I think being. Mm-hmm. Relying on convenience is out. You know? Like, I, I want to like force myself to like. All right, Noah, like, if you want to go on a run, you can't just, like, go downstairs and run the treadmill. Like, go for a run. You know, like, that kind of thing. Or if it's, like, oh, I can just Uber eat this. Go walk to, and get your food. Or yeah. go drive and get your food. Like, I want to, like, be more active. And, like, cook. In. Cooking. Great one. Yeah. Um, well, my, my kitchen's gutted at the moment. It's, like, I have no kitchen. What? Run, renovation. Oh. It's bad right now. It's, like, really bad. Like, I don't want to be home. Oh. So, so where do you go? I'll go to friends' houses and just kick it. Don't do that. No, I, Don't do that. <laughs> no, I uh, no, I mean it's it's livable, barely. Like I have, they like, haven't touched my master bedroom yet, which is nice. Okay. No, it's just they they just haven't gotten there yet. So it's like you have a one bedroom apartment right now. Basically. Yeah. And yeah, so my kitchen's gutted. My my den. Area like uh-huh. your man cave vibes. Yes, okay. that place just finished actually. Okay, oh. it looks fucking amazing. I'm really? so happy. Yeah, I'm so excited to see. I yeah, I love this is like your first house. So you I know like, it's, it's fully customized. So it's like it's really fun. But cooking, I told myself in 2023 when my kitchen is done, I want to like eat or I want to cook 80 percent of the meals I eat. Period. And I don't know how I'm gonna keep track of that. I guess like. <clears throat> I don't know. I, I I think one meal a day, I'm like cooking. Yeah, which would be nice. At least breakfast. And even if it's like meal prepping. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say. Eh. Breakfast is the easiest to possibly do. It's I love just, cooking. Breakfast is so easy. So but I want like I want like rice and salmon at the end of the day. Like I want to cook. But that. that's like the easiest thing you could do too. So I've heard. Heard. What's her name? Salmon and Emily. Emily. Emily's a queen. Yeah, it's, it's meal prep. Kind of, that's that's where. But okay, listen. Salmon and Emily. This is this is where I'm gonna get you. I'm not a fan of meal prep so because crazy. I recently made like meal prep and I had like the last, I think it was the last day. That shit was ass. Oh yeah. It's not right. good. Right, right, right. I'd rather just post. I've heard people say meal prepping's out. It's like it's get so your out. lazy ass up and just cook for five minutes. Like, okay, calm down. No, I. It's yeah. not, not my words. I have someone said that to me and I was like, I don't right. meal prep. I just Uber eat. And oh. it's like, Uber way. You know, I don't have that money. I know. It adds up, and I'm like, I could it just really cook. Does. And so, like, when I get my kitchen, when it's done, I'm gonna like cook. There you go. Okay. Yeah. Now, I think you're gonna agree with this one. In dogs, right? What's out? Gay people. Okay. <laughs> the room. I keep watching this <laughs> band <machine. laughs> Okay. Um, agree or disagree? Because I'm not homophobic, but. They do it a lot. <laughs> they as <laughs> <I> me <mean>, poop. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Um, I will say out 
I'm not a big fan of people who have like hamsters. <laughs> like your sh- little rodents. Little rodents. It's like yeah. your your room smells like shit, Stephanie. Like let's get it together. And you're like you can't even find them half the time. Unless I'm I mean, not yeah, and they bite. Ferrets. Oh my god, I was about to say. They're, no, that's the don't smelliest do that. one. Oh my god, they're, they're so cute. terrible. That's the smelliest one. They smell like sh- ass. They smell like shit. Water. Yeah. They, that's the smelliest one. They're so one. cute. I would so definitely. Long. I can see like a um like a cat. Oh. Oh. Are you not a cat guy? Oh yeah. I like I like animals, but like, why do you see me with the cat? You just you get like the rock every time I think of you. You know, the rock had that one black shirt with that necklace. That's crazy. With the cat. Why do I give that to you? Yeah, I don't know. You just get preppy. Like you have like a books and you know like tea and just cats in your house. That's not a bad thing. Oh, like that old money vibe. Yeah, like you just. Mm. You, you know, I love a good old money vibe. No, no, not the rock with the cat shirt. The rock with the shirt <laughs> is the rock with the turtleneck. The turtleneck. Just look up rock turtleneck. That's what I see when I think of Noah. Yeah, th- this is an iconic photo. <laughs> <laughs> this is not old money. Like this is like Noah, I could so see you like waking up in the morning and putting that on. <laughs> hey, hey, honey. And you'd eat. You made breakfast. <laughs> Hello there, white chocolate. Like how you like your eggs. <laughs> okay, how about this? In in am I am I supposed to fill in the blank here? <laughs> you I got one? scared to say. I got nervous. Um, no, I don't. Okay, I got nervous. I bitched out. Just say it. no. Would it hurt my feelings? No. Okay. No, no, no. I was just I was gonna say like Would it even... someone? Uh, no. <laughs> okay, then just say it. Is it gonna offend anyone? It's more so for the gay community. Oh, taking her man. What? Ben this is not. This is. This oh. doesn't go for me. But in if you're top, telling the bottom before you want to have sex with them so they can prepare because yeah. bottom means go through a lot. Yeah. I'm not saying this is for me. I'm just saying in general. Out. I don't want. I'm not a out talk. spit. The, okay. Or people who like feet. Let's, let's really, mm, no, let's really get into not that. The, oh, don't kink shame. I'm not kink yeah. shaming, but I'm sorry. Wiki feet scares me. You have one. You have one. I, I have what? One. A wiki feet. What is that? The pictures of your feet and you search them up. I don't know why. I don't, I don't think I have the cutest toes. I have soccer feet. But like, feet. some people like that type of stuff. That's They're, weird. I don't, I don't have a wiki feet. Search up no I don't one. think I have one. Because like I don't post my feet ever. Yeah. Yeah, I've never had anything oh. with my feet. I don't think I have one either. Uh, humbling. It is. This is humbling. Is. Okay, maybe it's like you have to go like a. <laughs> no, it's like. Oh, I almost said. No, the get side. get ready. No, that's not right. We definitely looked you up on here. Wow. <laughs> Wait. Whoa. We have never done that. We, yeah. No, no, no. We, 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 I was there. We've been on Wiki Feet. What is that photo? Oh my god. Photoshop. It's crazy. What is that photo? I swear to god, I've never taken a photo at that angle. I said. Better than you. Yeah. How about this? In. I mean, I don't kink clothes. shame, but like, like, I really don't shame. Like, you do you, but it just gets weird at a point. It's like... I mean, not weird. People will do a lot to, like... For some feet. Not even just for their feet, just, like, anything in general. Like, some people are just, like, weird. Like, being out... Sweat. No, being out is weird. Like, being... What is out is being weird. Like, overly weird. And it's like, you know you're being weird when... When I start being weird. No, it's just like... Oh. I feel like some people... Ugh. Because if you're being weird, I'm going to start being weird. So I'm gonna Maybe? Like, I feel like I'm so moving. Like, <laughs> okay, like, that's what it would mean. I'm going to make sure you know like, that I'm turned off. Like, I'll show my forehead. Like, if I'm uncomfortable, I'll, like, lift it up. Well, that used to be such so, a big yeah. joke for us. Like, like a guy, we'd hang out with the guys, and they wouldn't be looking. And then I was like, my hair. <laughs> they turn around and like, <laughs> yeah. You're on something. Be weird is fun. <laughs> what? <laughs> Bitch, you yeah. like feet. Oh, no, I don't like feet. I, I agree. Being weird, like, I like some creepy shit. And creepy as in, like, you know, like, I like... I guess not weird. Like, I'm not like, my senses before. Because <laughs> now you're going to think I'm a creepy bitch. Creepy as in, like... No, we're going to leave it there. No, I think creepy as in, like, I like 
like you know sometimes heavy rock and like just shit like that people consider weird joking weird no I think weird as you're talking about is like you know like the fee and like the peeing and like the I think no <laughs> well, I think like I think if you're like being weird like I don't know like being quirky and weird like go for it like liking di- different things like that's great but the the second that you start to like do things to like make people feel uncomfortable in like a weird way like just like overly oh that's I, different it's just like it comes to a point where it's like oh relax like yeah I for I think I think I see where you're going for example for me when I see a gay person being like overly flamboyant and they know that they're like they're making it their personality mm-hmm. and you, you don't really see like who they are for themselves it's just like the flamboyancy is all that you can see mm-hmm. that is kind yeah. of the overdoing it for That's me exactly. where I'm like who are you let's bring it who down. are you when you're not performing for others <gasps> the gay shirts the gay shirts you can't even think straight right I'm like oh right. no ah. <laughs> <laughs> here we go no. I always had some like down. I've had some like especially in like, the fashion world I've had some very interesting encounters that have just made me feel so uncomfortable I'm just like would you like to share? Let's talk no about oh. I don't think I can do like, you mean like people being weird to you in a yeah sexual yeah, yeah okay. and it's them. no I don't want to do that it's like I'm not going to share it's like look yeah like it's normal like to be like flirty and and like are we talking like gay guys doing this or just like it's anyone. Been, anyone. Yeah. It's been anyone. But it's just like I bitch say I pull. <laughs> no, I, it it's it's weird to the point where like like that's the kind of uncomfortable like if you can't tell that someone's uncomfortable and you yeah. like don't let off the grass, it's like what do you get out of this? Right. Yeah. Like do you like making me feel uncomfortable? Some people do. It's yeah. weird. I one thing I'll stop putting your hand behind my back. <gasps> that makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Because I mean? 'cause I'm I guess people think just because I'm very flamboyant, especially like straight men or even just men in general. A lot of men will put their arm under my back or like on my lower back when they're talking to me. Or like, like I don't know, it's weird. Interesting. Straight men? Oh my god, yeah. yes. And then, oh my god, straight men, leave us alone. <laughs> Please. That is so... I understand, you know, I'm a, I'm a strong believer of, you know, being curious about your sexuality, but don't um, allow somebody to be your test subject because then it's not fair to the other person. Yeah, like don't assume that you're just like up for it. Yeah. yeah. I personally I hate, hate pursuing. I would never pursue like a straight man. That's what we're talking about. Yeah. I, oh. I'm, I'm loving gays. Gay community. Out. Stop only wanting oh, to split men. Yeah. Because it's not a real thing. It's yeah. We all are gay. Well, we not even gay. that. More so stop wanting the straight man. Yeah. Yeah. That so. you just dream will be gay for you but won't. Well, you know? Yeah. It's just out. So. A, lot. Like a masculine gay man is pretty common now and then. It really is. It really is. And it's like, it's like we're all gay. So right. why make it like a, a weird thing where it's like, oh, you you wear makeup and now I'm, now I'm not attracted to you. Yeah. Okay, we right. can paint your nails, Timothy. Yeah. We've low key like, been talking about that. And like getting into like feminine shit is like not a bad cool. thing. You got scared no. to say it out loud. You're, she's still working through it. I'm working through it. I'm working through it. I'm working through it. Uh, it's something that's just like in for 2023 and just should always be in. It's just like manners. I feel like so many people have just like forgotten like manners. Mm-hmm. And like such an easy yet such an important thing for like, especially with like first impressions. Like that's like one of the first things I notice about someone is like how like you act. Mm-hmm. And it's just like if you're, I don't know, I think manners are just so important. Like, they are. Yes. Like, please. Thank you. Mr. and Mrs. like that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Basic respect. Basic. Yeah. Bar so low now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is Ins, self-respect, outs, stop allowing, don't like appreciate the bare minimum. Don't text me that. Yeah. Cause Isn't like, it? Yeah. I, I remember I heard my friend, she was like, <laughs> yeah, like, you know, he doesn't hit me. And I was like, girl, that's the bare minimum. Yeah. No man should ever hit you. <laughs> no, yeah, that, that should not be like the. That's not like a requirement, babe. That's like, like a. Yeah. Of course, you should respect you as a fucking woman. Yeah, I feel like. Man, like, start holding the door for girls. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was like the best thing ever. Stop. Start. Oh, like, okay. Well, I was gonna say a date. Chivalry yeah. opened the door and I was gagged, and I shouldn't be gagged. Chivalry and gentlemen like it, yeah. should, it should always be in. just manners. Yeah. yeah, just manners. I think empathy. Empathy is also very, <clears throat> like. Literally, I think the biggest thing that I kind of learned last year more than anything is, I don't know, like before I made like any decision or before I said something to someone, 
or before I acted out of like emotion, I really thought like, imagine how they're feeling. Like imagine like putting yourself in their shoe, you know? Does that make sense? Yeah, it does. And like, this happened recently and like owning up to your mistakes, like just recently actually, this was like the first time in a while, but it goes to show like how close I am with some of my friends back home in Arizona. Um, it was with Bryce and Tyler actually. And this just goes to show how like, comfortable I am and like only them, only they will see this side because I'm just, you know, it's mm-hmm. how we are. Um, and I've been friends with them since I was like six years old, seven. And we were playing, we were playing pickleball actually. And I'm like man enough to admit this, but we like all are very competitive. Like mm-hmm. we grew up athletes and like always competing with, against each other. Yeah. And like we've been doing it for so long where we kind of like know how we, like we react to certain things. So we get in each other's heads really easily. And I don't know, like, I don't know. It was like, I'm not gonna make excuses for myself, but it was a mix of a lot of things. Like I was just so like pissy and like such a poor sport. And I was just so competitive. And even when like, I won a point, I was just like, I was just out of it. Yeah. And then we left. Oh, did like, you say something out of pocket? No, like nothing like out of pocket, like nothing, like I didn't say anything out of emotion. I was just like pissy and just very, just like, I don't know. You were just in a mood. Yeah, I was in a mood. And I told him like right after, I I like, I I sent him a voice message after like we went home because we were going to go out later that night as well and like hang out. Um, So we did this during the day and I like went home, showered, got some food. And then I was like, hey boys, like, I don't know who that was back there, but I'm sorry. Like you guys know that was like out of character for me and like it was just weird it was the weirdest thing they were like yeah like no stress like that kind of yeah. thing but it's like, I, yeah. it's like character de- development in a sense. i feel like so many people just act out of emotion and like i like caught myself before i could say anything that's that's stupid yeah. <clears throat> yeah. You know, I, feel like, I feel like they appreciate that yeah yeah it's a sign of maturity you mm-hmm. know do you tell your friends yeah. that you love them i do i always have okay good not in like a not in like an overly like. There's no such thing as overly loving. No, no, I was just I just caught myself. I was like, eh, that's not true. I love you, I love you. I always just say it like after like when we leave, I right, peace, love, like that kind of thing. Peace, love, happiness. And no, all of that. Keeps me bad at it. Eat, pray, and love. I don't even know what you're talking about. <clears throat> Used to be bad at it. It would make me so mad. Affection. Like, really free, yeah, I'm just terrible at it. Like, I'd be like, like, I'd hang up, I'm like, okay, I love you. And then he'd be like, bye. And then I'll call back, and I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> and that would be me too. <laughs> I'm like, like, yeah, you forgot some words. <laughs> he what asked me the other day, he was like, how could I be more like a better friend? And I was like, tell me that more. I love growing. <clears throat> oh my God. Stop. Stop. No, we're, no, you're doing good. That's so sweet. What are you saying? You're growing. Nobody's perfect. Sorry. Um, oh. Before we wrap it up, or whatever we're about to do. Mm-hmm. Um, do you have any like concrete like resolutions for yourself? Well, we did the ins and outs, and like I guess that could like set us up for resolutions. Mm-hmm. I've been so I started. Two did you write four. Down? Oh, mm-hmm. but I started two weeks before New Year's because I feel like starting on New Year's is just like yeah, it doesn't really like why start then? Yeah, it's like you kind of got to be in the habit for it. I started reading, going to the gym, eating healthy. I mean, I. Kind of the past few days I've been bad at it, but I caught myself, and I'm trying to go to bed early. Love that. Yeah. So. That's really, good. There's a lot more about it, so I kind of like want to yeah. to myself. Anything like, I mean, those are like major like lifestyle mm-hmm. things. Like, I, I, I swear, if you do that for a month or two, or like if you stay consistent with that, I feel like it's oh, yeah. just going to be good. Oh, yeah, and I'm also going to be in that space, but also it's, like, I think it's more so like finding time for myself and like also like making my brain develop more because you know yeah. we're not in school we don't like really do much all we do is sit on tiktok all day so i was like okay this is not really helping me develop as a human being so i started reading and that has helped me so much like in a sense of like like things about myself because i read i read about like self-development so like right the book i'm reading right now is like um 14 laws of growth and like even that just like teaches me new words teaching stuff about myself teaching me how to like you know care for others and just kind of teaching me how to like do you like the right way? Love that. Yeah, I was so gonna say I was gonna ask what books you're reading. So it's more you like should read. Should we give him the book? There's a book that the guy that I'm talking to read, and he was like, "It's banned in prison." First of all, it's called 48 Laws of Power." Okay. 
it's crazy. It's literally like a book about like I don't know how to explain it. You just need to read it yeah, because yeah. it's insane. I shouldn't read it though. You shouldn't because it's gonna. Like, you're just gonna be powerful. He's gonna like float. After you know how like Scarlet Witch of the Dark Hold? Oh no. That's what the Dark Hold looks like to me. <clears throat> it's a lot. It's a lot. It tells you how to like be a better person, but also be like a shitty person. Oh wow. Yeah, also, like being a good person, but also like keeping your guard up. And yeah. Oh, how to manipulate. That's kind of, I like reading it just because then it helps me understand other people. I already, those points right there are always... You those, said something that's those huge, are some good points. Wow. Like, by us not being in school anymore, it's like, how much intake of an education do we get anymore? Yeah. Like, none. None. Because well, we that's, live through our phones. Well, that's what I was saying. Like, I, I literally think it's so important to go into anything, like, anywhere with an open mind. Because... Literally, just from sitting here and talking to you, I can learn something. Like, yeah. that's why I think it's so important to, like, when we're done with school, never shut off your mind. Like, mm-hmm. literally, even even things from TikTok. Like, you can sit on your phone and, like, think that you're, like, wasting the day away. But, like, you might come across a few things that's on TikTok strange. that are very, like, insightful. Right. Yeah. And, like, even with, like, shows or, you know, watching motivational speakers. Like, I, I love just, like, always kind of, like, keeping an open mind mm-hmm. and, like, sort of learning. But yeah. that, like... Yeah, there's and some also good another there. thing, I love just giving tips on life, especially the viewers. Um, another thing I've been doing recently that helped me kind of develop my brain is if I have, like, let's say I, my back itches and in my head, I'm like, oh, why does my back itch? Instead of, like, not, like, you know, thinking about it, I'll Google it and I'll, like, try to, like, find little things and little reasons as to, like, what, like, why this happens or what is that. Like, yesterday, I, oh my God, we were watching videos about how does it feel to drown or like how does it feel to burn alive like just like all the stuff that you've never experienced but like you're curious and it teaches you so much do you know why we die from catching a fire what why do you think we die i assume you just carbon carbon dioxide poisoning so you're not dying because of the flames you're dying because you can't breathe Duh. And it, <laughs> sorry yeah, we were watching videos i was like fury <laughs> and when you drown Drowning is probably the scariest thing in your entire life. You drown or burn? I would rather burn. I'd rather drown. I'd yeah. rather burn. No, because I'm not drown. It's like a quick. No, burn. I'd rather drown. Because you can push quicker. out all the air. You can make it quicker. Drown, burning, like you can't control what how fast. Well, because you're burning, you're burning yourself off. So you're not even really feeling the yeah, burn. Yeah, you can feel it. You're dying because you can't breathe. You're burning all the layers of your skin, so you're in your nervous system, like it's already shut. Imagine right? I put a candle on your leg right now. Yeah, it'll hurt for it's gonna hurt right. for like 30 surface level. But if you're engulfed by flames, I know what you mean. Yeah. Like your the, your skin, your you're feeling like, of yeah. skin's gonna go real quick. You wanna feel it. I don't know. But that drowning, sounds so bad. Like, have you like think about it. Can't like drowning, like water filling into your body. Yeah, that would suck. But I mean if I like had no if this is literally one of these questions and I had no like out. And like I know I would just survive. Right? I'm literally just gonna like in the water, like I'll like push out all my air and be like, eh. yeah. Yeah, make it a quick one. Ooh. But yeah, yeah, that I mean, that like feeling of like not being able to breathe in the water is so terrifying. You like start like like you start like, when you yeah. <laughs> so like traumatizing. Yeah. You start like your body starts like, touching I'm like, like oh it's a lot for me to handle. Oh my god. Oh my god. I almost I drowned as a read that. In the ocean? Yeah, I almost drowned. It was not fun. Yeah, next time we uh, link back, you should have read this full book. I'll read it. You're going to love it. I will tell you that. <laughs> the no, it's not even He's a like a in the room. He's like, like, fly. <laughs> He's telling He's like, it, like, Larry's not even here anymore. He's like, so let's talk. I'm like, oh. And for, for context, there's been, literally, I'm not even kidding you, reading this book has helped me like communicate so much better and like move accordingly. And yeah. like, I've learned so much about how like, other people work. Damn. It's a lot. How many pages we talking? Wait, sh- Sorry, I was talking about the book. Wait, sh- rain. That's yeah. rain. That's full on rain. Yeah. Oh my heart. Oh. My flight. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Always say <laughs> less than necessary. Oh yeah. The always say less than necessary. Like I've heard so many people like. Yeah. Yeah. But it sucks because I like I like talking and like, explaining I'll myself. I'll tell but it's like, my life story. Um, it's a lot. And it's always like. The, the loudest person in the room is usually the dumbest. Yeah. And it's like... <laughs> I disagree sometimes. I, I do as well. I don't think that's always the case. I no. think sometimes, like... Depends on the room. You know when they're dumb. Let's be real. Yeah. yeah. But also some people kind of play dumb. Definitely. Yeah, like, look, yeah. don't outside, never outshine the master. Like, yeah. let, people, actually, let people true. underestimate you. Yeah. So many... Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's crazy to think because it... 
like if, if someone was telling me all these things like three even four years ago i'd be like all right like relax don't take it that like it's not that deep it's just life but then as you grow older you start to find yourself in like rooms with people and yeah i don't know it's they just, start to apply it's a lot more insightful mm-hmm. now than yeah. it was then because you can, yeah you can start to apply it and it like makes sense <laughs> okay guys since we're so big in communication we have to tell you that we are going on a hiatus it's not forever so we'll definitely see you in a couple of months but noah has a lot of stuff that he has to commit to so he can't commit to this schedule and i have to get a bbl so, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so i'm joking uh, but like yeah we'll see you guys eventually you know we need to I feel like we talk a little bit too much sometimes, so we need to take some time for ourselves. We gotta go be mysterious. Yeah. And we gotta let you guys, we gotta leave Miss you guys with some, yeah. yeah. Leave you guys questions. Leave the people wanting. More. Yeah, exactly. But, like giving us too much. No, but yeah, we just have a few busy months coming up and it's hard to commit to like a certain schedule, like in terms of filming. Um, but yeah, you guys know where to find us. Like we'll still be posting on other stuff. I can't speak for you. Unless you're, are you just gonna ghost everyone? Whoa, that was a lot. Apologize. Quickly, speak up, Mike. I'm sorry. It wasn't me. Oh, my God. The book. He reads <laughs> one chapter. <laughs> um, I will be posting on other stuff as well, duh. Like, I will not, like, totally. I'll be editing. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you guys soon. Well, yeah, that's it for this episode of Put a Sock in the Podcast. I'll see y'all next. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I know. Oh, yeah. We don't have a definite date. I'll see you guys soon. We're actually gonna miss y'all though, and like, thank you again for supporting us I'm and so listening so and watching your stuff. You can always go back to like, do a little, a little, forty six episodes. Yeah, so do much. a little walk to memory lane. Go back. Yeah, forty six episodes. Yes, girl. Y'all didn't even make it over. Over. Go back and start over. A I'm walk thinking of all the things I probably have said. Oh, please. I know. I, I like. There's some shit in that. Oh my god, it's crazy. Okay, well, we love you guys so much. We'll see you guys eventually. Other than that, we'll talk to you guys on Instagram, TikTok, or Twitter. Not on this channel. So that's Jared the President. Oh, you're a Snapchatter. I, I, I won't friend. be. I deactivated it, so. Oh. Yeah. I can't. Oh, you're gonna deal? Mm. Yeah, you see, no one posts for money. I love Snapchat. I love you guys. Bye. We'll be back. Alright, peace guys.